So one of my best friends just started seeing a new chiropractor and then mentioned that their bestie is a chiropractor who does NET. Allegedly, the chiropractor's eyeballs rolled so far back into their head that it looked like they might need an exorcism. NET is not really chiropractic, they declared. It's more like energy work, like Reiki. This grinds my gears so hard. No shade on energy work or Reiki, but NET is not that. Let's roll back to basics. First, at its root, chiropractic is about restoring balance to the nervous system through handsy methods by way of the spine. Chiropractic means done with hands. The spine, with its 24 vertebrae, is kind of analogous to the electrical panel in your house. Each vertebrae, just like each slot in the panel, goes with a nerve or electrical circuit that feeds into something in your house or your body. Just like each circuit spot can send electricity to a whole bunch of different items plugged into that spot, each nerve at each vertebra level also feeds into a bunch of different stuff. That's why sometimes you can feel muscle pain in your shoulder, but it's really because of a problem with your gallbladder. These different areas share room on the same circuit. Three, emotions are not energetic or just up in your head. They are physical. They are in your body. For example, I have a fear of heights. I get a little sweaty when I stand on a chair to change a light bulb. If I think about standing on the edge of a cliff, I get a little sweaty too. But once I climbed up to a high log on some adventure course at my kid's summer camp and I almost passed out. My legs started shaking uncontrollably. My heart started fluttering. My breathing got weird. My voice was shaking. I got dizzy. I was scared. That was not in my head, that was in my body. I couldn't cross that log. I had to climb back down. Once back on solid ground, my heart came back to normal, my jelly legs turned solid again, and I was okay. Although my fear response to heights is more intense than a lot of other people's, I had a pretty normal response in that my body went back to normal once the threat was gone. Where NET comes in as a legit physical treatment is when someone gets stuck in a physical stress response that is not letting up, even when the danger is long gone. This stress response is not an energetic thing. It manifests in very real and measurable symptoms like elevated heart rate or blood pressure, unrelenting muscle spasms, decreased range of motion, dysfunctional deep tendon reflexes, dysfunctional proprioception, etc., etc., etc. So the NET chiropractor uses pre and post adjustment criteria just like any other chiropractor to make sure that they are addressing the right problem with the right solution. Way back in 1910, D.D. Palmer said that all spinal subluxations came from three causes, trauma, toxicity, and autosuggestion. In modern speak, that means injuries, biochemistry, and emotional stress. Therefore, emotional problems in the body, which again have a huge physical component, have always been a part of chiropractic philosophy and practice, and NET is a specialized approach to help people with that kind of stuckness. And that is all I have to say about that. Good day.